there, folks. This is Richard of DoomedMovieThon.com. I am back with another episode of My Horror Shelfie. My Horror Shelfie is a series where I talk about every single horror movie on my horror movie shelves from A to Z. So, this is a special Halloween edition of My Horror Shelfie. What makes this so Halloween-y? This totally authentic Halloween jack-o'-lantern. Well, as you know, if you've been following this series, I've been stuck in the letter D for a long time, and I wanted to skip to the letter V because V is more interesting than D. So we're going to talk about all 7,000 of my VHS tapes. That's right. For the next 16 hours, I am going to talk with you Unedited, completely uncut, no cuts. This is one of those one-shot takes. Hi, boom, hi, boom, hi takes. So let's go look at my collection right now. It's impressive. I have miscounted. I do not have 7,000 VHS tapes. I have seven. But let's talk about them, because they're important to me. To me. First up is Primal Rage, a little uh, Italian horror shot in America. Specifically, this is in uh, the United States of Florida. Love a good Florida movie. And hats off to my pal, David Assassino, for hooking me up with the one and the only Primal Rage. Uh, This is a sneaky Halloween movie. If you watch it all the way through, you get to see the sneaky Halloween party at the end of the movie. Sneaky! Speaking of Florida movies, it's Phantom of the Ritz, which was filmed at the Ritz Theater uh, right here in the old Tampa. Uh, This is a ridiculous comedy horror film with really, really bad jokes. Uh, The narrator is crazy. Much like Primal Rage, uh, this was covered on Hello, This is the Doomed Show. So if you go to the podcast archives, which I'll have a link in this uh, video here, you can listen to my buddy Nafa and I talk about Phantom of the Ritz. Did someone say Tampa movies? I know I didn't. It wasn't me. Uh, This is Impulse, (laughs) starring the one and the only William Shatner. Uh, This is a beautiful tape. I love this. Uh, My buddy Nafa and I also discussed this very film on Hello, This is the Doom show way back, way early episode, Uh, but also filmed in Tampa. Uh, You've got uh, William Shatner and the dude who played uh, Odd Job in the Bond film. This is a fine Tampa film and a great, great William Shatner performance. Highly recommended. Speaking of my buddy Nafa, uh, this is The Quiet Earth a film that he and I enjoyed talking about, though we should have done it on the podcast. Um, It's got good old Bruno Lawrence in it, the patron saint of uh, New Zealand cinema, and this was uh, Nafa's $4.99 blockbuster copy, which is pretty great. Speaking of the Halloween season, it's Halloween Tooth, the sequel to the 1978 film that uh, John Carpenter directed. My buddy Brad knows about my love of the original Halloween 2, and he gave me this tape. I love this frickin' movie. I also love Rob Zombie's Halloween 2, so... Enjoy that fact. Okay, we're getting down to the last two tapes. Creepers. I'm all about that good old frickin' awesome Dario Argento. Uh, This was my first Dario Argento when I was a kid. I watched a show called This Is Horror, a.k.a. Stephen King's World of Horror on MTV, and they were talking about this crazy movie called Creepers. So I went down to the old Blockbuster video and rented it, and the movie that was in the VHS case for Creepers was a movie called The Creeper, a.k.a. In the Devil's Garden, which is a (laughs) British giallo-style thriller very giallo-y, and so I went back and complained, and in the case for The Creeper was Creepers, so I finally got to see Creepers, and I watched it a hundred times. I loved this movie as a kid. I love it now. 
It is still my second favorite horror film of all time. And uh, I barely need to watch it anymore because I have it memorized. Did I say my second favorite horror film? But what about my favorite horror film of all time? When does that get talked about, huh? Let me know before I do. Lucio Fulci's The House by the Cemetery, my favorite freaking horror movie. Um, I wish I could live inside this movie. It is so perfect and wonderful. Uh, I love Lucio Fulci so much, and this is like every horror movie that I saw on TV as a kid smashed into one crazy freaking Italian piece of art. Weirdly enough, I did not see this one as a kid. <laughs> My first Lucio Fulci movie was actually Conquest when I was like 11 or 10 or something, and that was very strange. But uh, House by the Cemetery, it's just, oh my god, I love this so much. Um, I first got to see this on the old, uh, I want to say it was the old Diamond DVD, the budget DVD, I think it was Diamond, and I just fell in love with it, and I, oh my god. This tape is one of my treasures. Folks, it has been a wonderful time talking to you about my huge ass VHS collection. Man, can you believe it? It's been 16 hours since I started talking about all of them. I'm gonna dip into the uh, special effects budget right now and drop some serious Halloween, um, like Rick Baker style effects on you right now. Hold on to your butts. Hold on to your butts is a reference to an American werewolf in London. It's a direct quote. This is the whole budget. Happy Halloween. Mm. I'm Rick Baker.